17 News. Again this morning we're dealing with a nationwide Microsoft outage that's impacting services from banks to grocery stores and even our own systems here at Fox 17. Yeah, of course, developing situation. We know a fix is being worked on, but in the meantime, this is impacting much of the world. Lauren Coomer is at Ford Airport, and Lauren, we know it's not just uh, Ford Airport. Uh, flights all across the country now yeah. being impacted. Yeah, that's right. The FAA is actually assisting many of those airlines in ground stops this morning because of that global outage. And as you can see, it is impacting Gerald R. Ford Airport right now. Over half of the flights are either delayed or canceled. And as of right now, Allegiant has put a ground stop on the flights. Just a few minutes ago, they actually came over and said that they'd be issuing people refunds. Those flights before noon, uh, any flight that was scheduled to fly out with Allegiant was going to be canceled. Now they're telling those people that are are standing in this line over here to stand by. So we're actually seeing this line wrap around this entire area of the airport. And we have one passenger here, Katie, who is being impacted. Katie, tell me what you just heard over the PA. They're, they're probably canceling all flights before noon. And it's not going to be, you can basically call customer service and possibly get your money back in 48 hours. And are you from Grand Rapids? Where are you flying to? Yeah. Phoenix. And uh, were you having to be there for work? Were you having to be there for something specific this morning? I was going to go visit a friend who's sick, so I was going to go see her, but I guess not this weekend. So tell me a little bit about how it's impacting your travel plans and, and kind of how you feel about it. Um, well, I had to take time off of work. I had to use PTO, so um, I guess it's just not going to happen. Thank you so much for all the information. Uh, and as you can see here, this is just one of the hundreds of passengers that are here waiting in line. Earlier they announced that if people were not uh, having to check a bag, they could just go right through the TSA checkpoint and um, go into that area and wait by their plane. But uh, as you can see, lots of people getting out of line, lots of people frustrated this morning. Now, of course, we will continue to keep you updated all morning long on the latest of what's happening with the flights here at GRR. Of course, stay tuned to Fox 17, both on air and online for the latest information. For now, I will send it back to you in the studio reporting live in Grand Rapids. I'm Lauren Coomer, Fox 17 News.